we have a brand new logo for Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, a confirmation of the main villain and a brand new supporting character, and that Guardians 3 is the end of the Guardians era. So this comes at us directly from San Diego Comic-Con and even James Gunn, the director of the Guardians of the Galaxy himself. He said that Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 is the end of this Guardians era in the MCU. And just because it's the end, it doesn't mean everybody dies, but there is a lot at stake here. And also, a big confirmation was made in terms of characters that we can expect to appear in the film. The High Evolutionary is in fact going to be the main villain, and Cosmo will in fact be in the film. Now again, there's also some other stuff that they're teasing, such as the fact that Adam Warlock will of course have a pretty big presence in the film, and a couple other things that we can expect to see that they don't want to necessarily spoil, but they're saying that it is a emotional film, and that everybody there felt like this was a good time to end this version of The Guardian. So again, Things are sounding pretty serious for this version of the Guardians and what they're going to be doing and what exactly is going on in terms of, you know, the bigger picture, if you will, for the MCU. And I think this is like an end to one version of the Guardians, but obviously the start to another and sort of a goodbye and a hello, if you will. Out with some of the old and get them out of here and do whatever you will with them in other projects or retire them and bring in some new ones, which obviously Cosmo, Adam Warlock, and the likes fall into that. So it's sounding like uh, we're in for a, quite an interesting ride for this upcoming film. And they're definitely saying that there's going to be some interesting stuff like Baby Rocket Raccoon. That's going to be interesting. That's going to sell some plushies. So, um, Invest stock into Pop Funko, I guess. <laughs>